<laughs> All right, we off. Here we go, mine, sir. Let me put it right back in. Absolutely will, sir. Wow. Well, it was bad when we walk away. Oh, Woohoo! All right, now he's going the wrong way. He's yeah, I walked away from you. See, well, <laughs> you ready take? Yeah, I see that. You ready to take a whole tree down? Great, let it fall. All right. No, that was not good. <laughs> I get to watch that on cam. Watch me take my brains out. <laughs> Songs that I'm thinking of right now. Torn between two lovers. <laughs> I, I've got that spot and that spot that I'd like to go to, and I ain't sure which one to go to. May not be either one of them, but. <laughs> but if you notice, uh, have you when you walk to the woods, when you walk, find the trail, the, is the trail like this or is it open? So uh -huh. you, looks like you way off, my friend. Then again, you know, you might be in the right spot. I can't tell you. No, I'm just talking. Just I know, but I'm talking to you. Do you remember this area in my videos? What, it, what, what, when you come up to this location, you see what? What do you see when you come in this location? Damn, you take, I'm pretty good at knocking these trees down. And you ready to take this one too? Well, no, leave it. You should leave them always, leave them standing so they won't get rotten. But he, uh, looks like, uh, bulk. <laughs> he, he's like Bigfoot. He tears down trees. <laughs> That's correct. So I know it ain't that way. Nope. <laughs> I know it ain't that way. That'd be the wrong direction. 
See, see what he's doing? He's finding six direction. Six direction will show you where everything is through your mind. You're looking at this uh, the, the field above your head. And he's saying the right things. He knows where the highway is. You know where the camp is. Don't make these fall now. You got branches up there. Uh, <laughs> Look, he's uh, Simon. Samson. Yeah, whatever. And I wouldn't push that one there's you. Neither one. Yeah. See, yeah, the, see those branches up there will fall hit him in the head. Aha. Uh Aha, -huh. uh -huh. what do you find? I found that orange station for one. That'll get me going, get me going in the right direction. There's that stuff again. Yeah. What I tell you what? Oh, uh, some weird plant. Nothing weird about it. <laughs> Run through it. Must have dine. All right, he found the grumpy has found some orange flagging. Now, which way to go? <laughs> oh, that one's all right. It's it's green. <laughs> So he got. Have to find me a spot. It take about five minutes. So he got lost twice in my trail, and he's gonna take a little break. We find some orange flagging, and uh, we're gonna take a little break. All right, we're back on track. We took a little break. So he needs to figure out where he's at, where he needs to do. He found this orange flagging. So let's see where he takes us from there. This used to be really flooded because there was a well over there and this whole area got flooded with water. And uh, it, camera. Camera. Okay. it killed all these ponds here. You're all that water. And I hate when people say, you're all that, that pond sucks up all that water. Then why these trees are dead? <laughs> they had a broken pipe over there and they have a natural spring too. And the park over here has a natural spring. I'd like to show y'all that one day.
婚したい Yeah. So we were safe to hit the base. Triangle. He made it to the Bianca Triangle. He's gonna get lost in here. Oh, Jesus. Yes, I call my son. He finally made it to the Bianca Triangle. Mike got lost in this thing like a hundred times. And he walked in circles in this one little spot. Believe it or not. Watch the video. It's called Ranger Cookies and Mike's Adventures. And there's the hole that Mike stepped in twice. Oh, and never a hole if I stepped in it. <laughs> right there. And don't forget, boys and girls, I'm not going to starve to death tonight. <laughs> wouldn't, wouldn't grumpy guy starve tonight? Yeah, grumpy guy feels like he's starving right now. <laughs> Them two eggs is about gone.
Like you only like tw 10 more feet and you to the road. Yeah. So I know it's not right. Because you should have just said they had to stay in the woods. Correct. I made the trail so we can, won't be seen and questioned. So that's why I made the trail in the middle from the highway to the thicket. Oh, definitely off the trail. But you can get to it from here. Look at all them skeeters. Think about getting one more of those, uh, those badass skeeter things that we have at the base and keep one on this pouch. Yeah. Now, it's not battery, it's a gas. Swarming right here like flies on a dead carcass. Yeah, no. Ouch. And one more thing I put out here, I put false flags out here. So when you do find a flag, hey, look at a flag over there, and you run over there and find out you're in a dead area. <laughs> yep. So I trick people too. See, there's a flagging right over there. Now, believe it or not, this was my old trail, but it got into the swamp. Is in water, and I try not to get it in that water area. That's why I made a summer trail and a winter trail. Now, he is in my old trail. Now, if he can just get us back to the trail, he might get us out here on time. Well, I'm already over my 15 minutes, so I ain't worried about that. He found another flagon. See, this is one of my cross points. I made a cross point. One way is the right way, another way is a, just a loop. You get lost. I planned it that way. You see this flagon. Oh, there's another one over there. And you walk that way, and it's the wrong way. The real way is that way. Which way? To go back to camp. That way. That way. 
Now, he's getting to the spot where the hidden trails are no more hidden. It's a trail. You just have to find the trail area. Like I said, all the time, when you get into this open area, it's called open trail. And when you get into a closed thicket area, see like this, it's all thick in both sides, you have to make a tunnel trail. And that's how people find your trails through the tunnel trail. But when I get into the open area, I, I take different routes. So you can't see where I cut or where I stomped or... So he got lost three times in my trail. But he's still a good trail master. He found his way back with a little help and sometimes no help. You can watch the video and you see, oh, he didn't have help here. But he did a good job. He did an excellent good trail master job. He's almost home. He just had to find out where the rest of the trail is. Take a look at this area. And about 20, 30 yards that way is a big ditch. We try not to get across that. What's wrong? Yeah, ditches, it, it runs across all along the side of our, my trail. And I try to get as far as away from the trail for a couple of reasons. Uh, wildlife and bugs. Don't worry, we're almost out of the building. Yep, we found another flagon. Take a break right here next to your flag. All right. Hey, that's the we're talking about. There's the trash to survive, and right over there is where's the uh, where I found the bee and the smoker or barbecue yeah. pit. And there's the trash. Let's take. I'm thinking I'm gonna come over here and masturbate. Oh man, look at all the goodies. <laughs> Goodies, man. Look at all the goodies. Look at it. Look at it. <laughs> and this is where I fought Mr. B over here. I came through here and I found the doggy kettle. I found the big old thing of uh, some PC pipe, a bucket. Now that, that, TV, and the smoker thing is over there. Satellite, but we can get good satellite out here. And look, crawfish traps. You can take those bottles and make crawfish traps out of them. A couple of glass bottles that we don't need. Unless you try to do some flit and make an arrowhead out of it. And that's it. Look at this. Man, I can't wait to get home. Oh, yeah. Oh, yeah. <laughs> and he's coming close to where I almost step on a rat snake. You see it in one of those the, the videos past one of these videos. Now he's in the tunnel in the tunnel um, trail. So he should should find his way to the last of the bit of this trail. He found another flagon.
And look, there's some more trash over there we can use. Another big pile. There's another big pile over there. Oh, dang it. Wish a mosquito went in my mouth. Yeah, I hate when you go in your nose. Yeah, that'd be worse in the mouth, that's for sure. And this is where I fought that big rat snake right here going across. I thought that he was going to eat me and swallow me. That's why I got over that log. <laughs> well, if you look on the ground, you shouldn't worry about having stepping on snakes. He's almost to the end, and we get the time. I'm mean, minus, minus, uh, what, seven minutes. And see what prize he wins. Does he win one? Does he win all three? Or win two? Let's find out when he gets to the end. He's getting close. He's almost burning up. The trail should be easy because look how thick it is. And see how... If it's thick, that means you have to clear out a spot. There was a gentleman trying to follow me through the woods because he didn't know what I was up to. He got lost. He couldn't follow my trail because he got lost. He said, we Yep, there's the tree stand. Oh, you see it through the thicket? Okay, there's the tree stand I always talk about. I didn't know it was there for about three months. I'm like, and one day it was cleared. I'm like, look, there's a tree stand there. Yeah, we're almost home. I could go get the car and pick you up at the inn. And here I made a, a circle. There's a big pond there, or, or not pond, but a big hole. And during the rainy season, it's all wet. I had to go around it. So he's taking a round trail. But he's getting there. He's getting it to the end. Many he touched concrete. That's when we stopped the time. Almost walked through the banana spider. <laughs> and look, another beautiful oak tree. Watch out, big banana. Oh, I'm sorry. You got the camera on. <laughs> I ain't here. Watch the banana spider. Get real close to the side. Yeah, you walk right through it. <laughs> Ouch. Now, if you want me to, I can stop you and tell you to look for something. Oh yeah, you hot. I feel it. 
Oh yeah, you're burning up. You just have to look for something that you're supposed to be looking for. What are you supposed to be looking for at this time? Well, hell, I don't know. All right. Look, wait, stop where you at. I want you to look up into the tree lines. Now look around and tell me what you see. Just walk, just turn around and look at all the tree lines. That's, especially when it gets where the blue is. See where the blue is? Yeah. Now look around and see the blue line. Go all the way around and see the blue line. Now which blue line is the clearest? All right, now look down this way. Okay, now back up. Always look in different locations. Now look down this clear. Uh, oh, sorry. That's all right. See that clear line yeah. right there? Now you see any lower than this? See that low blue clear line? Lower than this spot there. Okay, now look around and see if you see any other blue clear line. Now what that tells you. That tells you there's something cut there. There's a clearing over there. So if you're looking for it to get out somewhere, you look for a clearing. And that's how I do my trails. I'll look around. I'm like, okay, look, it's blue real low here, but it's not here. It goes up, 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 down. It's clearing over there. And But you can see the blue line is really low here. So I should be going that way towards the bluest, clear line I could find. <clears throat> Walking through trails over many, many years, I look for these big clearing. Like over there, there's a clearing. So maybe there's a house there, maybe, or a pond. Uh, it's real low, bluey. See blue down there, it's really low, see it? And over here, it's high. And a little low here, but not that low. And a little low over there, but that's where that where the dead ponds are at. So we need to travel towards that blue lawn. Or maybe. I don't know. He needs to find a trail again. And when I was looking for the bamboo on the bayou, because we was on the bayou one time, and what I do, I look into the woods and see a big tree, and I remember that tree what it looks like. Uh, then when I come around, like, see, there's that big tree. Well, why don't you go back to the trail and see what where you were, maybe where you turned wrong at. You're not far from the trail. And remember, all that crunchy noise, that means in your wrong trail or the vines in your way. Now, look up. Look into the blue sky now. What do you see in the blue sky? blue sky? See how blue it is and it's real low and you can hear corridor slam? Uh, I can. Well, I can. Oh, look, listen. You hear that sound? Oh, I heard that one. Okay. So now where you need to go? 
even though you're in the wrong way again because the trail tells you I'll be all right. Look how blue it is over here. So he heard the sound of a car truck or somebody yelling. Okay, all right, I'm just going to and give him time because the time period starts right there in this little hole. So I'm going to give him time right where he's at. So, how long did it took you? Let's check the time. Hour and 15 minutes. Hour and 15 minutes. That means you have won one prize. He got lost four times in my trail. How long? An hour and a half. Hour and a half. So it took him an hour and a half to go through my trail. So he won one prize. He could pick out the knife or the machete. And later on, I, there's a mystery box. It's going to be given to him if he stays out here for seven days. That was my rules and my challenge to any of my YouTube people. And now y'all get to see if he stays seven days. You get to see what's in the mystery box. All right, I'm Ranger Cookie, and this is... Wrong big guy. We had fun in the woods. I oh, hope buddy. you... I hope you enjoy the video of uh, the Mr. Grumpy Guy getting lost in Ranger Cookie's Adventures. Alright, Ranger Cookie, see you later on!